Hey guys, Tal the Wicked here with another Bee Swarm Simulator video. Hey guys, I just got this beautiful star treat here. And I have two of these exhausted bees. One of which I have a bee quip on. Let's see if we can... This one. And then one of which just has a mutation of energy. I have been wanting to go get the puppy bee. As you can see, I don't have that discovered yet puppy bee here and I want to give it the star treat so I am gonna go buy the puppy bee in the gift shop I have enough tickets so let's go in here and buy the puppy bee so here it is 500 tickets so let's go ahead and buy the puppy bee and we'll leave the shop here we're gonna go back out here and I'll just put it in that spot where that second exhausted bee is so Open the camera there, see that exhausted bee? So let's grab, they're both colorless bees. So if we look in here, so this isn't an exhausted bee, it's in the epic bees. So I've got two of them here. As you can see, it's colorless. And the puppy bee is also colorless. Here's puppy bee, also colorless. So let's go ahead and put the puppy bee egg on here. Let's take a look at our brand new puppy bee. There it is. Puppy bee. So I'm just going to drop that right there. Transform exhausted bee. Yes. Yes, please. So here we go. We've got a, a playful bee who only cares about two things. It's tennis ball and you. Now since we've got this beautiful star treat here, and I believe that's the only way you can get the puppy bee to be gifted. I'm going to go ahead and give the star treat to Puppy B. So it's now a gifted Puppy B. By doing that, you get the gifted bonus. So this gifted bonus, it gives Hive bonus a plus 20% bond from treats. So every time you give a treat, let's see if actually giving a treat to itself, it gives a bonus too. So let's give one treat here. So it gave 13. Normally they give 10. So it gives three more bond per treat. So actually, let's see. How many did we have enough treats here? I'll take it there. Oh, we don't have enough to upgrade it to another level. But we'll go ahead and give it that. Let us also, let's give it a mutation while we're here. So you give it a neon berry to begin with to make it, to make it radioactive temporarily. And then I give it, and then you can give it bitter berries. What I like to do is give them 11 at a time. I found it's roughly 100 to 150 that you get a mutation. But sometimes you get lucky. Boy, this is being very laggy. Here you go, puppy bee. Have some more bitter berries. So there's 22 we've given it so far. No mutation. Let's try again. 33. No mutation yet. Oops, not neon. Bitter berry. 44 now. Oh, we're just increasing its level. Uh, I can't see. There we go. 55 now. There we go. We got plus 8% attack. So I'm happy with that. I need attack. So now we have a gifted puppy bee. So we're getting closer to getting that supreme amulet. Supreme star amulet. I've got the diamond one right now. So let's see how many unique bees we have. We have 39 types of bees. So the next star treat I got, we will we will give it to another bee, and we'll have 40 and be able to buy the supreme amulet, or supreme star amulet. Like and subscribe. Bye, guys.